old observatory, built in Sydney more than a century ago, has always been a place where accurate time is essential. From 1858, the observatory has provided a service to navigators. The observatory, of course, is also used to observe, and this telescope has scanned the heavens as astronomers have studied the stars. Dr. Wood shows how photographs are taken and then put in this machine so the stars can be measured. And if you'd like to see the planets and stars close up, here's what they look like. This machinery is not for stargazing, it's for clock watchers. And the clock is a copper ball six feet in diameter. The time ball is controlled electrically. The ball replaced the first one o'clock gun because a visual signal was more accurate for skippers wanting to set their chronometers. It's almost one o'clock now. There it goes, a split-second time service from Sydney's old observatory.